Hello everybody, welcome back to Chibi Robo. So, last episode was kind of crazy. We discovered that aliens can come to our backyard. Uh, we had to buy a special chip to listen to them. And it turns out they were friends of Giga Robo and are very sad that he is dead now. Yeah, that was, it was kind of, kind of a deep episode. Also, the pirate ship is now back in business and we got free treasure maps! Which, if you remember from last time, uh, lead to three different treasures. Let's try to find some of those today. It's daytime again, so let's see what's happening around the house. I also might try the space scrambler again today. Come on, just dig up the dog bone. Come on, dig up the dog bone. Only let me do it from one side. Oh hey! The flowers are sprouting. The dog bone watch should come in handy later. It's the dad! That's great! Hey, Chibi Robo! <laughs> We're still missing one Chibi door, though. Dum de dum, time to water the lawn. Chibi Robo! If you stand there, you'll get all wet! And that's dangerous business for a robot. So stand back. I was going under the water spray. Worked that time. And now he actually is throwing water on me and he doesn't even care. I'm watering the, sh the swing, Chibi Robo. I'm a big help. So you'll remember Treasure Map uh, C said, uh, fly from the hollow tree, or fly from the tree branch and dig at the hollow point. So the first treasure is on this tree somewhere. Alright, no. I don't think there are any more invisible doors. And the bluebird is still blocking our path. Oh, is this... Oh, wow. I can't believe I never opened this. This is the last chibi door in the backyard. Three hundred bucks. Nice. So we hover from this branch onto this one. And you'll see there's a hollow point there. We take out our spoon. And let's dig. Wow! That was magic. Someone out there. You came to save me. Someone will spot us now. Could you come back later? Oh. Because Dad's outside, we don't actually get to open it. <laughs> now Captain Plankbeard will take it from us. Oh well, at least we got the last cheaty door. Also, I'm not sure if I've shown off the stickers since we've gotten any of them. We have the Utilibot sticker, the Frog sticker, Mr. Prongs, Hot Rod, and Cooking. Maybe we can get the Space Scrambler t uh, sticker today. You do not have to shoot every single target in the Space Scrambler in order to get an S rank. You have to shoot almost all of them. But I, don't, I do not think it's actually possible to shoot every single one without running out of time. Anyhow, welcome back to the kitchen. Hey Tao, what's up? Ah, oh, something smells good! Is that for me? Um, I'm not giving you the dog one, no, sorry. That's pretty lame! Sorry, bro. There actually is a point in the future where we need to save a dog bone for that, so... I could prob probably be able to get another dog bone before then, but you never know. Great Pico is still not in the fish tank again. I hope I didn't miss my only chance to give him the snorkel and goggles. Oh, here is, here is the Great Pico. I've been waiting to see if, he's, if he was ever going to go up here. He is standing on a burning burner. I am threatening to withstand this heat! The body is terribly, terribly hot! The wind, the mind must be remaining over an oasis of cool. If I maintain the temperature of my mind, I will increase the strength of my mind's eye! Um, I, think, I guess he must be a porcelain doll, otherwise he'd be burning up. 
Fool! What are you doing? Never disturb me while I am training! No, no, I must be calm. I was upset because the temperature has been lowered. I will not let it bother me. The temperature of the mind is always consistent. Okay, well, you have fun doing um, that. I'll just be cleaning up some trash. Nothing. Oh, that's right! The last chibi door in the room is up there. I... I revealed it with my chibi blaster, but I ran out of time before I could actually enter it. How could I forget? It's because I blocked that memory out on purpose. I'm like, are you sure there's nothing hidden in my room? Because I'm pretty sure the last one is hidden. Wait, I thought, hang on, but this Finn's eyes were open when I was on, uh, what? Oh, lame. That chibi door's eyes were open when I saw it earlier. Tisk, tisk, you shouldn't be slacking off. Oh, but Sorry, I don't mean to rush you. You have a lot on your plate right now. Oh! So how about this? Hey, check it out! I'll sing you a song. It's called Teriyaki Blues. Man, the game just really does not want Telly to sing his song. Goodbye! I just gave you 21 happy points! Spread the happiness! I promise you, you eventually get a sticker for doing that enough times. Alright, let's recharge, then try the Space Scrambler race again. Wanna fly with us? Yes! I'm gonna get this S rank eventually. Wanna hear the rules? Nope, I'm good. Good luck! Yahoo! You guys ran out of time too, though. You're also not shooting anything. We're literally the only ones doing anything in this mini game. All right, I gotta stop being so gun crazy. Shot a lot of targets, and now we can have a long straightaway where we can just speed up. Come on, 
Oh yeah, there's also the love letter on the stairs, which you probably get. Alright, this time we're doing better. Yeah, there we go. S rank. Sweet. Okay, that actually wasn't too bad once I got the hand of it. Still harder than the chicken race, though. Nice flying ace. That's a new record. Or this one's easier once you know exactly where to shoot. The other one's hard just because it's basically a frame perfect input. You two are a perfect team! Whoa, that was some amazing flying! Fairbanks just gave you 26 happy points! <laughs> Bama just gave you 26 happy points. Spread the happiness. Oh! You got the Space Scrambler sticker! You really are amazing, Chibi Robo. Uh, that I am. I, I am the greatest. Let's see, I'm not sure if there's really anything we can do in the bedroom, so let's run over to Jenny's room, see if we can do anything there. We're getting to the point where we're actually running out of side quests to be able to do in the daytime. Darn it. I can't reach that frog ring. And it's all because of... Get yeah. off of me. It's all because I forgot to climb the parents' bedroom door when it was open. And now it can't be open. I'll be able to get it eventually. The mom won't stay locked up forever. But we have to advance the plot to a point where she'll open the door again. Jenny's room. What's happening in Jenny's room? Well, first I can throw out a bunch of trash. Robin with A! There go the free weeds. That is a lot of cookie boxes. You got a total of 60 happy points! You got 600 bucks! It's a toy telephone! You might be able to talk to someone though. Not right now, I can't- um, hi. Dude, I think you really need to take a chill pill. Two more chibi doors in here somewhere? Hey, hey, dude. Did you bring me the lictor? If you've got it, then hurry up and pour it all over me! I got water. I think you need to sober up a bit. Did you just spray my butt with water? That's cold, you doofus! Nectar might be cold too, you never know. Oh, Mort's not in his cove today. Alright, there's definitely a hidden chibi door or two in here. That's pointing me up towards the castle. Alrighty. Oh, hey, Princess Pits. Nice to see you walking around again. Who's been reading me flowers? It must be a secret admirer. I'm sure he's just a wonderful person. He is, but he might not be what you're expecting. Also, don't let him touch you. He might kill you with a single touch. It works on flowers, anyways. Alright, I believe the hidden door is here somewhere. There we go. That's a nice hiding spot for a door. Even though it made me climb up the tower twice to get it. Alright, is there another hidden door? There is not. Alrighty. Is that the final door? Can't tell if its eyes are open. That one's a closed. Uh, 
Okay, the flower bloomed already. It literally only took like six hours for it to bloom. You actually do need to plant a nectar flower there in order to advance the plot of this specific side quest. The flower blossomed. More just gave me furry free happy points! Spread the happiness! <laughs> I'm not here, I'm just invisible. What kind of power does he have? Then I accidentally touched it. You purposefully did that, dude. That's okay. I killed it. I made it hideous. Like me. Oh, this poor guy. And it was such a pretty flower. Oh! God. No. Poor Mort. Oh, but he's just gonna DK roll away, so it's okay. That was so creepy. I, it killed me. It, is he the one who's been bringing me the flowers? It's like Beauty and the Beast, but they're toys. He captivates me. I get lost in his dreamy eyes. You screamed when you saw his face. But when I think of his face, I faint with fear. Okay, Princess Pitts, you're, you're a little bit of a drama queen. Let's, let's try to remove the drama from the story. <sighs> it happened again. You see, I... I'm terrible with scary things. I need your help to work up my courage. I've got to get over this complex. Folks, this is the one and only time of the game you need the ghost suit. Hey, beautiful. I want you to wear that and scare me. I'll try to bear it for him. But she's very sweet, though. She's like, I don't want to be scared of him. Hey, Princess Pits! Okay, it's not that scary. The laugh is a little weird, because it's Chibi Robo, but... I thought I was going to die from fright. Chibi Robo, more, more. Are you a bit of a masochist, Miss Princess Pitts? Okay, um, you're still fainting. I thought I was going to die from fright. Chibi Robo, more, more. If your girlfriend's telling you this, you, um, might want to have a talk with her about it. Okay, this time she said ack instead of eek, and she didn't faint. I'm starting to get used to it. Please, Chibi Robo, more! Okay, it's the same sc scare over and over again. Come on. <laughs> It's not that bad. I want to see a YouTube video of Princess Pitts plays Five Nights at Freddy's. No, <laughs> ah, your battery's low on energy! Oh, how much energy does it take to scare people? A lot, apparently. I thought I had almost full battery. Sorry, lady. Needed to recharge my spooky juice. But I'm here. I did it! I did it! Woohoo! I overcame my fainting spells! I mean, you still screamed, it was just quieter. Thank you very much, Chibi Robo. Princess Pitts just gave you 30 for happy points! Spread the happiness! Also, the second hint for the pirate treasure was for this treasure you'll need many keys, I believe it said. Treasure map B. To find this treasure, you will need many keys. It's referring not to actual keys, but piano keys. 
run on the keyboard, and this ch chest will appear. Also, the chests will not appear until you get the treasure maps. So even if I ran on the piano before getting the treasure maps, it wouldn't have done anything. What's in this chest? It's a creepy stuffed animal plush! Beat you to it, bud. Neptune's beard! They be getting here before us! Captain Plankbeard, sir, let's just steal it from them, sir! Yar, ye briny imbecile! Ye think a pirate would do something so dirty and dastardly? <laughs> He's been watching Jake and the Neverland Pirates. A real pirate never takes another person's property. I don't think Disney understands how what pirates are. <laughs> Gahar, let's get to sailing, mateys! Good thing not here, really did, otherwise he would have gotten it. It's Primopuil. I think that's how you pronounce it. Oh, cool, last cheeky door's in there. All right. Actually, that could be a little tricky to get. Hey, Scary Teddy, uh... Maybe, maybe lay off the nectar. I, I don't... Have a Snickers. You're not yourself when you're hungry. Snickers, if you're looking for a sponsorship, um, look at a different channel, because I don't make money off my videos. Oh man, if we have enough... Hopefully it'll time it just right so that we can get the last chibi door and still have enough time to get the love letter on the stairs. If we can't get the letter and love letter on the stairs, that's fine. But it would be nice. I like how the hat Jenny got at the beginning is located in the shelf area. Oh, come on. Wow, because I didn't chibi copter on the pink present, I can't get that. Wow. Next point of attack. Hope we have enough time to get the love letter. Because we definitely don't have enough time to go all the way back up there and try hovering down again. This is going to be a short episode. Because most of this I can probably cut out. It's not our business, dude. That's very noble of you. I'm touched. I just gave you five happy points. You got five bucks. But I'm curious, so let's read it anyway. Tell me the worst. <laughs> just like on Sesame Street. Ahem. <laughs> Dearly beloved, I hear your valiant footsteps from afar. I see your shouldering the burden of justice in stoic silence. I watch your fearless figure fighting evil from afar. I feel you near me at all times. But can our love ever be free? Will our hearts ever grow wings? I could never change who you are. I could never ask you to abandon your brave galactic duties. I can only watch in love from afar. Quietly. It's not about you, Telly. Not everything's about you. I could never ask you to abandon your brave galactic duties. If it's someone in the house... Oh! I wonder if it's... No, our love can never be free. Oh! Well, let's just pretend I never read this letter. I think a flower would be a nicer flower. I don't know what you're thinking, but it tasted just like chicken. <laughs> Chibi Robo, are you falling asleep in the middle of the stairway again? Chibi Robo, do you need to spend some quiet time with good old television? Oh! I'm 
just so exhausted. Not a very eventful day. Great work out there! Your chibi ranking is still six. In order to get the next bonus battery, you need 50 more happy points. Let's go! Oh, you're here, Chibi Robo. Would you like to say? Yep. Yeah. That's where we're going to leave this episode for today. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. I'm Colorful Artie. Tune in next time. Now that it's night again, well, there's a couple things we could do. We could visit the aliens again, see what they have to say. Uh, now we can actually get the treasure in the backyard because we couldn't get that earlier because Mr. Sanderson was watering the backyard. <laughs> and hmm, what else? Not a whole lot else we could do. I mean, I think we can continue the love letter side quest and hopefully the great Pico will be in the fishbowl. I don't know. Who knows? Anyhow, until we meet again, my friends, have a great day and God bless.